I hear some people, they're feeling very scared because their income's going backwards. They're freaking out because, you know, they're working longer and harder for less. Not cracking the code on how to attract top producing realtors to make you their exclusive without the hell of cold calling. That's the elusive butterfly most mortgage professionals never crack the code on, you know, and a lot of mortgage professionals will cope by saying, oh, I don't like working with realtors. They're annoying. You know, they're prima donnas. They think their poop don't stink. You know, they're micromanagers, they're flakes, they're disloyal, and they'll label them with all these, you know, uh, deprecating labels that have them cope by virtue of saying, I don't want to work with realtors anyway. I want to generate my own business through my database or through consumer direct. And if that's the case, that's cool. If you can figure out a way to grow your business to do that, by all means do that. What I found though, unfortunately, 99.9% .9 of the time when people do that is number one, they don't fully maximize the repeat and referral business and rave reviews they can get from their database. So they're leaving a ton of money on the table in their database if they have one. So that's impinging upon their growth. And if they don't have their uh, database or if they do, but you know they're wanting to diversify beyond that, they haven't cracked the code on how to attract top producers. They might have a bunch of you know whining, civilly complaining, jelly donut eating low producers that send them maybe one, two, three deals a year. But attracting the top producers that do 20 plus buyer side transactions a year who can send one, two, three deals a month. That tends to be the elusive butterfly for most in this business. And so the number one reason why your income is going backwards or why it's stagnating, if indeed it is, because you haven't figured out how to crack that code. Because if you think about it, who has the highest capacity to send, to send you the most amount of referrals most often with the most qualified, hot for what you got, ready to get a mortgage and buy a house now type of clientele that have their poop in a group when it comes to their finances, their credit tends to be higher than average, their income tends to be higher than average, you know, their DTI tends to be dialed in such that it's easier to convert them into a closed deal and so on and so forth. There is no better source of that kind of high quality, highly qualified borrower than top producing realtors who make you their exclusive, who put you on their speed dial, who send you all their business all the time. And what's great about that is it doesn't matter if rates are up or down because people are going to continue to get into the market, move up in the market, get divorced and die. And all those require transactions. So that puts you on a solid footing to become recession proof to be least and last affected by market conditions so that when the storms hit, and it's not a matter of if, it's just a matter of when those storms hit, you're least and last affected. It allows you to build your business on a rock solid foundation that's as recession proof as it could possibly be when you build a dream team of say seven to 12 rock star top producing realtors who send you one, two, three deals a month consistently. You think about that. Think about how much more elegant, how much more simple, how much more streamlined that approach is versus cold calling the same 40 freaking realtors every Monday. That's doing it the hard way, right? Why would you want to herd 40 cats when you can work with just seven to 12 rock star top producers who send you all their business all the time? You love and adore them. They love and adore you. And to be in a situation where you have a meaningful partnership, where you provide massive, unique value to them, and they stick to you like super glue and they become your brand ambassador. They become your evangelist and they're sending you all their business all the time because, you know, they see you as irreplaceable and indispensable. Think about the power of that. Now, that might sound a bit like, you know, too good to be true. You might be listening to this and say, Doran, that sounds too good to be true. Is that really possible? Well, as Henry Ford once said, whether you believe you can or you can't, you're right. And chances are, if you believe that you can't, it's because you've been doing it the hard way for so freaking long, you think that's normal, right? You might think that, hey, working with top producing agents who send one, two, three deals a month, that sounds nice, Dorn, but uh, you know that's kind of like the Loch Ness Monster. You hear about it, you talk about it, you never see it. Well, welcome to Planet Prosper, because in our world, we see that all day, every day. That's just how we roll. Monday to Sunday, baby, that's just how we roll. It ain't nothing like a chicken wang. That's just how we roll, because when you have the secret sauce to attract top producers, to be able to book appointments with top producers, to be able to cultivate a meaningful relationship with top producers, to get top producers eating out of your hand, to have a, a power position that is elegant, 
and simple and allows you to maintain your dignity and allows you to flip the script so that the realtor needs you more than you need them. It changes everything because now you can write your own ticket. You can book appointments at will. You can do the appointments such that they're eating out of your hand. You can do the appointments such that they're literally chomping at the bit to want to work with you. How is it possible to do that? Well, that's precisely why smart, ambitious, growth-minded mortgage professionals hire us is to learn that secret sauce. So that is the single biggest reason why your income is stagnated or going backwards. You have not learned the secret sauce and how to do that. And until and unless you learn how to get that key that unlocks the vault to whatever level of income and freedom you want to achieve in this business, you are going to be thwarted. You're going to be working longer and harder for less. I liken it to building a skyscraper. I use this metaphor all the time because I think it's so potent to depict the contrast, the juxtaposition of working hard versus working smart. The higher you want to build the skyscraper of your dream, your income, your freedom, your autonomy, your independence, your impact, your contribution in the world, the, the, the prosperity that you want to live in and breathe in and to be able to you know, create generational wealth. And if you didn't come from a wealthy family, may a wealthy family come from you, like creating transformational impact in the world with wealth, with impact, with, with lifestyle and with legendary legacy. The higher you want to build that skyscraper of your dream, the deeper you need to build and dig the foundation. But if you're digging that hole with a gardening trial, we got a problem, right? That's doing it the hard way. There's something called an excavator. It's a whole lot more meaningful, fruitful, fulfilling, and fun. So why do it the hard way with the gardening trial? And unfortunately, most marketing companies and so-called mortgage marketing coaching companies will get you doing it the hard way with old school methods from the dark ages, like cold calling the same 40 freaking realtors every Monday. That's caveman style marketing. It's the 21st century friends. There's no brownie points in the bank for doing it the hard way. So as long as you continue to allow this, you know, elusive butterfly to elude you, you're going to work longer and harder for less. You're going to continue to, you know, just throw yoga to the fan, hoping something sticks. You're going to continue to show up to the gunfight with a butter knife. That tends not to bode very well, right? Once those bullets start flying, you realize there's real consequences for wasting your time, time you can never get back, right? Real consequences for not knowing the words that work to attract these realtors, not knowing how to differentiate yourself from the sea of other loan officers, not knowing how to be a welcome guest. Instead, you're just an annoying pest, not knowing how to do the appointments such that they're chomping at the bit to want to work with you. And what that does is it has all that money, all that opportunity fly over your head to your competitors, right? That's not the way to create an abundant life. That's a way to continue to hemorrhage opportunity and leave money on the table to your competitors and leave market share on the table to your competitors. So again, there's no merit badges at the bank for doing it the hard way. So I submit to you guys that that's the single biggest reason, the single biggest reason why you're struggling or why you're stagnating or why you're regressing is you have not cracked that code. And I submit to you that once you do learn how to crack that code, it's going to change everything for you. It's going to be like you've been in a dark, damp cave and all of a sudden someone just flipped on the lights and turned on the heat. It's going to be a whole new world for you. So with that being said, this is the reason why most people fail at working with realtors. You might even have colleagues or you might even be able to relate to this yourself where it's like, man, I don't even like working with realtors. It's kind of like someone who says, I don't like sex, right? If you don't like sex, you're probably doing it wrong. Same thing with working with realtors. If you don't like working with realtors, you're probably doing it wrong. You probably don't have the value proposition. You probably don't have the posture. You probably don't have the words that work. You probably don't have the ability to overcome the objections. You probably don't have the ability to diagnose their pain and uh, give them a solution for what ails them. You probably don't have the ability to be a whole pie expander instead of you're a, you're a piece of pie taker. If you're a piece of the pie taker versus a whole pie expander, you're going to feel that it's a grind because they're going to be pushing you back with apathy, with resignation, with cynicism, with a high wall of distrust. You're going to have a lot of no-shows. You're going to have a lot of people pushing you off and sloughing you off and you uh, have a bunch of BS excuses. Like I already work with a lender or, you know, uh, call me back next week or call me after summer or 
whatever the lame ass, you know, smoke screen excuses, those are all decoys. It's just buyer defense mechanisms, right? You go into a store and the clerk says, can I help you? What do you tell them? You say, no, I'm just what? I'm just looking. That's a buyer defense mechanism. These realtors are giving you smoke screens and BS excuses because you don't have a compelling value proposition and you don't know how to bypass and sidestep their BS excuses. Once you learn the secret sauce on how to do that, you can book appointments at will and you can cultivate relationships at will, but you have to learn the secret sauce. And it's the single most potently powerful and profitable skill you can learn in your business. Because think about it. Is there any other category of potential referral partners that can use, can send you more business more often than a top producing realtor who becomes your brand ambassador and send you all their borrowers all the time? Obviously, every other potential referral source is a distant second place. True or not true, right? So the reason why most mortgage professionals fail when it comes to realtors is they don't know how to do this stuff. And so they're coming off as just another mortgage parasite, another loan leech. They're coming to get instead of to give. They're offering the same old, you know, lame ass value proposition of great rates, great service. They're following the herd, cold calling the same 40 freaking realtors every Monday. I mean, who wants to pick up the phone on a Monday when everyone in their freaking dog is being trained to call realtors with a lame ass or non-existing value value proposition and you're wondering why you're not getting the results. Well, wonder no longer. If you're just following the herd and doing what everyone else is doing, you're just going to get lame ass mediocre results because mediocrity by virtue of its definition is being average. Following the herd is being average. If you want to be the top dog, you can't afford to be following the herd. You got to be zigging while everyone else is zagging. So, here's the key to working smart versus just working hard. I'm going to break this down for you real simple. Okay. You've got to learn three simple strategies. Three simple strategies will crack the code for you and will allow you to earn more while working the same or less and allow you to put more zeros and commas in your bank account than you can ever imagine. You can take it to a quarter mil, to a half a mil, to a million, to two million plus in this business. The sky is the limit when you master these simple three steps. Okay. The first step is you need to be able to target the right realtors, not the whining, simply complaining, jelly donut eating little producers that do new, no business and have no capacity to refer you, right? Why work with someone who can send you one deal a year when you can work with someone who sends you one, two, three deals a month, right? It's, it doesn't make sense, but you might have a erroneous presupposition thinking that it's easier to get the lower producers. So I'm just going to go after the low producers. No, it's actually going to take you more time because they're going to be more prone to micromanaging you. They're going to be more, more prone to distrusting the process. They're going to be mo more prone to meandering and wasting their time and yours because they don't have the right mindset. They don't have a top producer mindset. And they're going to be just, again, chasing the wind because you're not getting referrals. Who cares if you have relationships if it's not driving your revenue? Seriously, like who cares if you're building relationships, if they're not driving your revenue, stick that in your pipe and smoke it, marinate your mind on that for a moment. We're just calling it tight. If you're going to build relationships, let's have them drive your revenue. So the first step is to target the right realtors, realtors who are top producers. We have a rapid fire re realtor reconnaissance system that allows you to target the realtors that are the best realtors in town, in any county, in any state or you know, any place you want to target. And it allows you now to be able to identify who are doing the most amount of business, who are doing the most buyer sites. And who's doing that business in terms of the loans? You get to see who's leaving it to happenstance and who actually have a, has a preferred lender. Who do you think's an easier pick, a more low-hanging fruit, the one who has a preferred lender or the one who doesn't? Obviously, the one who doesn't. You can see with lucid clarity who has preferred lenders and who doesn't using this realtor reconnaissance system. So now we're building a list of 50 to 100 of these top producing realtors doing 50 or rather 20 plus buyer sides a year. You build that list. Now, the list does not make you money. What makes you money is how to monetize that list by virtue of having a system for getting these people hot for what you got. And that's what we call our Realtor Attraction Campaign, our RAC. And so all you do is you load your list of top producing realtors into our RAC and bada bing, bada boom. You start to book appointments with these top producing agents like a hot knife through butter with the words that work that gets them hot for what you got, okay? And then we teach you 
how to do those appointments. So step one is get the list. Step two is book the appointment. Step three is to know how to do the appointment. Now, how to do the appointment is not show up and throw up with a data, a data dump talking about how great you are. How to do the appointment is not to just, you know, talk about all the great loan programs you have and how long you've been in the business. You've been in the business for a while or, you know, talking about how the, you're going to be able to help them doing this and doing that. They don't give a rat's ass about any of that stuff. What do they care about? They're all dialed into the same station. W I I F M what's in it for me, but they're never going to buy the solution if they don't first buy the problem. So we need to diagnose first, prescribe second. So another thing that we teach here at Planet Prosper at MortgageMarketingCoach.com is we teach you the secret sauce on the intelligent, strategic questions to ask to uncover their pain points, their challenges, what keeps them up at night, where are their marketing engines losing steam, where are their hemorrhaging opportunity, where they're leaving money on the table. And then once they get connected to the consequence and the cost of hemorrhaging all that opportunity, just by virtue of having holes, gaping holes at the bottom of their marketing bucket, now they're chomping at the bit to learn how to hem up those holes. Now they're ready for the solution because they first bought the problem, right? So we teach you how to get the realtor eating out of your hand by first diagnosing their pain and their challenges and the gap between where they, where they are and where they want to be, and then giving you a full quiver of wicked effective systems, tools, campaigns, scripts, and automation to help them work smart as opposed to just working hard, to help them put more zeros and commas in their bank account, to help them show up and shine online with five-star reviews, to help them get more leads from their open houses, convert more of those leads into closings, to help them monetize and mine the gold from their database, maximize repeat and referral business, convert dead leads into hot for what you got leads. You get the idea, right? It's about helping them squeeze more profit producing juice from the fruit, working smarter, not just harder. Now, can you see how by you showing them how to be a whole pie expander versus a piece of pie taker, by helping them grow their business, working smarter, not harder, and closing more deals with less effort, by expanding their market share, by helping them have a better lifestyle and step into the promised land in their own life, in their own business, and to empower them and equip them to live their best life and their best business. Can you see how that's going to make you irreplaceable and indispensable? Can you see how that's going to be an elegant way to not just become a replaceable cog in the wheel where you're just another average Joe LO offering great rates and great service, but you become irreplaceable and indispensable? right? That's how we get them to put you on their speed dial. That's how you build a dream team of brand ambassadors, of evangelists who send you all their business all the time. Now, you might be thinking about everything I've shared right now, be like, Doran, this sounds amazing, but how do I crack the code on this? This sounds like it's kind of complicated. It's actually not that complicated. It's just a three-step formula. It's a three-step formula of targeting the right realtors, booking appointments with the right realtors, and getting those realtors on your team, on your dream team as exclusive VIP partners. And that's precisely why smart, ambitious, growth-minded mortgage professionals hire us is to learn that secret sauce to crack that code. And as I mentioned earlier, you can't just watch a free YouTube video, listen to a free podcast, or read a free blog to figure that out because it's not something you can just Google search which is why we've been in business for 17 years, helping mortgage professionals crack that code. So if you're listening to this, you're watching this, you're like, Dorn, I'm done with stagnation. I'm done with regression. I'm done with the up and down roller coaster ride from hell. I'm done with worrying where my next deal is going to come from. I'm done with having my results being way short of my potential way short of what I know I'm capable and worthy of, way short of my identity as a champion and as a winner. I'm done with mediocrity. I'm done, I'm done with falling short of my potential. I'm done with worrying and having sleepless nights and the, all the insecurity of having the bills stack up and having the income go backwards. I'm done with that. I'm done with not having the power to lead by example if you have a team. Because truth be told, your people are going to do double what you do wrong and half what you do right. So if you don't lead by example with your own growth, how are you going to teach your people how to grow if you're not growing? So you're done with imposter syndrome. You're done with not leading by example. You're done with feeling like you're settling for second best life and I can't afford it prison. If that's you, then I invite you to book a complimentary breakthrough call with myself or one of my consultants. 
we'll lift up the hood on your business. We're just going to have a real talk conversation on the phone. We're going to shine the light of truth on your situation. And we're going to look at where you're at now, where you want to be, what's working, what's not working. If we can help you bridge the gap between where you are and where you want to be, if we're hundred percent certain we can help you, we'll show you what that looks like. If we can't, We'll be the first to advise you to pass on our services. But either way, you will leave that meeting with massive value, massive clarity, and chances are we're going to have some fun. So if that sounds meaningful and worthwhile to you, and it definitely should, if indeed you're wanting to add an extra $100,000 plus to your annual income, even in the face of today's challenging marketplace, if indeed you're wanting to build a recession-proof business on a rock-solid foundation, so you're least and last affected by market downturns versus first and most, if indeed you're wanting to learn the secret sauce and the most potently powerful system on planet Earth for mortgage professionals to propel to any height of income and prosperity that they may desire to be able to take the shortest path to the cash to making freedom money in this business. If indeed that's you and you're a 100% commission self-sourcing LO in Canada or the US and you have an 80 basis points or higher compensation plan, then I invite you to book a call at mortgagemarketingcoach.com forward slash apply mortgagemarketingcoach.com forward slash apply. My name is Dorn Aldana coming at you from the Art of Mortgage Marketing podcast. I trust you got some value from this uh, little session here talking about the number one reason why your income is going backwards or stagnating and how to fix it regardless of rates or inventory. Now let's get after it, friends. It's not enough to just think about it, hope about it, wish about it. We got to do about it because we get paid on done, not begun. So let's get after it, friends. Let's take massive action. Bring massive positive energy to that action, and chances are you're going to get massive results. We'll see you on the next episode. Peace, y'all.